Hey, good morning, everybody. There you go. There's light. How are you this morning? It's this is Daniel, and this is morning tea. How's everybody doing? It is Friday. Yay! For all of you night to fivers, Monday to Friday people, it's Friday. Time to celebrate. For all of us who don't have a regular nine to five, it's Friday, right? <laughs> uh, I don't know about you guys, but for me, just Friday doesn't have the impact that it used to have. When I was working at a nine to five Monday to Friday job, uh, and, and promotions usually the weekends are the busier days, so my Fridays are usually my weekends are uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So anyway, but that aside, happy Friday, everybody! It is March eleventh, two thousand eleven, and let me start off with um, my prayers and good vibe goes to uh, friends. If there's any friends in Japan. Uh, with this, you know, with the earthquake, uh, my heart goes out to you guys. I hope you're okay. Uh, I'm sure if there was an earthquake, you're not watching this, but you guys get the point. Send your hearts out to that. Um, also, the tsunami in Hawaii. My dad, my friend uh, Dan Wiseman in Hawaii. Uh, we got word on Facebook that he is okay. He is safe. Uh, be good, my friend. Love you. And uh, I don't have off the top of my head any more friends in Hawaii, but. If I do and I miss seeing out, be safe, be good. If you can, if you're watching this, if you get to watch this, uh, my heart goes out to you. And uh, if you, if they can't watch this, well, our heart goes out anyway. Uh, be safe. So let's start this morning. It's actually earlier today. It's six thirty. I got a four o'clock wake up call. I'm wondering if I, if that was the city calling with those messages telling us that uh, we should evacuate, and I didn't listen. <laughs> anyway. But uh, I'll keep posting throughout the day so you guys will know if we're good in California. But I think we're, we're good. Okay. Actively participating, showing up for life. Showing up for your life means actively participating in your own life rather than hiding and going through the motions. The way we walk into rooms is a lot about the way we live our lives. When we walk into a room curious about what's happening, willing to engage and perceiving ourselves as an active participant with something to offer, then we have really shown up to the party. When we walk into a room with our eyes down or nervous and smiling, we are holding ourselves back for one reason or another. We may be hurting inside and in need of healing, or we may lack the confidence required to really be present in the room. Still, just noticing that we're not really showing up and having a vision of what we will look and feel like when we, when we do can give us the inspiration we need to recover ourselves. Even if we are suffering, we can show up to that experience ready to fully engage in it and learn what it has to offer. When we show up for our life, we are actively participating in being happy, a happy person, achieving our goals, and generally living, with, living the life our soul really wants. If we need healing, we begin the process of seeking out those who can help us heal. If we need experience, we find the places and opportunities they can give us the experience we need in order to do the work we want to in the world. Whatever we need, we look for it, and when we find it, we engage in the process of letting ourselves have it. When we do this kind of work, we become lively, confident, and passionate individuals. There is almost nothing better in the world than the feeling of showing up for our own lives. When we can do this, we become people that are more alive and we have the ability to make things happen in our lives and the lives of the people around us. We walk through the world with the knowledge that we have a lot to offer and the desire to share it. And I'm going to say that again. There's almost nothing better in the world than the feeling of showing up for our own lives. When we can do this, we become people that are more alive and we have the ability to make things happen in our lives and the lives of the people around us. We walk through the world with the knowledge that we have a lot to offer and the desire to share it. Whoa, what a great way to end the weekend. I just tell you, wow. You know, uh, I, I don't know if I still have it on my Facebook. I have that. It's like I'm an active participant of my life. Um, after we have a recovery, I, I decided that uh, if I was going to be clean and sober, then I had to. I had to take every opportunity and every chance possible. Examples, moving to California, going into acting, writing now for a magazine, uh, 
everything that comes my way, the yes and of life. And I did a video a long time ago about the yes and of life. Just yes and take yes, yes. I I I don't know if I can do it. I'm not sure if I have the potential, but I'm gonna try it because the worst thing that I can do is not try at all. To participate in my life it is such a blessing. The amount of people that I would have missed, the amount of opportunities that I would have been would have not been a part of had I not taken the chance to just show up and be there. Even the bad auditions that I was like, oh my God, really? Or, or the, 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 the shoots where I went and, and you know, you stood there for six hours and did five minutes of a shoot. But the people around me that I met and the connections that I, that I have now are just amazing. So it's Friday. And, and, and if you're not doing anything this weekend, plan something. Check out a calendar. Go do something. Get out of the house. You just never know. Get out of your head. Man, that, that helped me so much. What, two days ago when I was all in my head over a problem with a friend and I got out of the house and I thought, you know what? Let go. Anyway, uh, passionate a little? I think so, right? Yeah. Uh, but, you know, I, 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 I really believe in this one. You gotta show up, man. Gotta show up and just be part of life. Anyway, I'll leave you guys with that. Enjoy your tea. Enjoy your coffee. Uh, I'll keep you guys posted if anything should happen here in California. Uh, but I think the water's kind of fizzled a little in Hawaii. They kind of took most of the damage. Uh, our heart goes out to everybody in Japan, Hawaii. Be safe, everybody. Have a great Friday. And I'll see you Monday.